It's getting really dirty. We're gonna have like 40 sick people tomorrow, I think. Why are you still in here? Resting. Really? You know you can just go home, right? Hello everybody and welcome back to Academia. My name is Twister and today we are gonna be getting a lot more students. So 48 students are coming tomorrow. Everyone is going back from work. Why do we have so much so many groceries here? Like so, there's so much stuff here. Why? Let's take it in. I guess we don't have enough fridge space. You don't seem to be full. But we have enough food, right? I have no idea. Those are dirty dishes. Why don't you clean the dishes? I have no idea. Not quite sure. Alright, so I was going home. You just ate, that's fine. Just leave, bye-bye. Go away. There we go. Alright, so we should get a bunch of people today. Are we getting the people? Should be coming in today, right? Coming in today. When? I guess at 8 a.m. I haven't actually used this feature yet. We gotta double the amount of students in our school. That's gonna mean we need more janitors, because right now we don't have enough, because as you can see it's pretty darn dirty. There we go. There's the students. We have a lot more money. Alright, so let's go and finish off the computer lab because we're gonna get the money for that all the best thing we can do right now uh and the problem is with the current students is that we have a lot of we don't have enough teachers we don't have enough classroom that's a big problem so let's just make a tiny little computer lab here so we want to go over here go to objects computer lab i'm gonna build a bunch of computers in here again not doesn't have to be the be all end all of computer labs But it should be a decent one. So should we just squeeze them in? Get money back, right? Yeah, get all the money back. We just as long as it's paused, we can just build this whichever we want. So we actually have the entrance in the middle. We have a bunch of PCs around here, and I mean, might as well do something like this. It might be cool if we had it one more. I can actually make it like one block bigger. This, and then have a few PCs in here, right, you know? Like this. In the center. Again, that's overkill. Because we don't need six, right? Or five. So we're gonna just like ignore the middle ones for now. Because we want to keep save the money. And we're gonna instead just go to... Just leave these. Go get the chairs. I'm gonna add the other ones later. I actually might as well place the chairs, you know? Uh, let's have some chairs in here, just so we remember what's supposed to be in the middle. Now let's go to zones, let's go edit the zone, remove the zone and get computer lab. Again, where was it? Computer lab, let's get it over here. So those needs to be indoors, which makes actually a ton of sense. I'm gonna just get the walls here and we're gonna get a door over here and also probably could use a floor, huh? this there you go all right i like that a lot it's gonna get finished uh it's a bit weird that it's like not perfectly centered but it's okay all right so we have 48 students that have arrived that's great uh we need we need this new teacher so we're gonna get 5,000 bucks from the video the thing and which means i kind of want to go over here and build another one of these so again just remind me this it needs to be a total of 10 like this Another classroom. Let's go to zones. Get another class. Over here. Go to build. Get a concrete floor here. Again, a lot of money being spent right now. School is dirty. Yes, I do know that. It's very bad. Door here in the north area. We're also going to need a, another block, but I'm going to build it later. No biggie. Objects. Class. Room is here. All right, chalkboard goes like this. Office table, very expensive, goes over here. Chair goes like this. We need a bunch of student chairs still. So I kind of don't want to get them all in. It's okay. Okay, good. They cancel all these notifications, so, so many of them get a lot of money per day, which is good. Problem is we don't have a way to teach these kids. And there's way too many of them for this little tiny club, so that's also a problem. It's gonna get really dirty in there. 
It's okay. They're all laying out in the like on the on the floor, the grass. I'm gonna go to their classroom, and some of them are gonna just go to the library, I guess. And yeah, that's not so bad, I guess. You're gonna just at least study, I think. There are some students absent. That's fine. Like you go, like you're supposed to be studying, but you're not. You really have like very good knowledge of stuff. I guess you came in here with some knowledge from before. I don't know, it seems like they know a lot of stuff, honestly. They're doing great. Ladder is going up. Toilets might not be big enough for everyone. That's gonna be a problem. Okay, just finish this off. Oh, that's everything I need. I think the problem is with the game is... I mean, I think it's a problem. Is I feel like the time goes past, but time goes by, uh, time passes too quickly. Like, it's basically one second in real life is one minute in game, and I don't think it should be like that. I think it should be at least like three or four seconds for each in game minute, because they don't have enough time to do stuff, right? It takes them, it takes the students like 30 minutes just to go pee. I mean, we couldn't even test that. So it's third period, we went to pee, and he's like very much late. Okay, so they're gonna go to lunch. It's at 12. Let's follow this student over here. Let's follow her. She's gonna go pee before lunch. Again, she went to pee at, at noon. That's the male student. Oh, that's a male student. My bad, sorry. Like 24 minutes later, he exits the toilet. I'm gonna go to lunch. I'm gonna take some lunch. Eat it. Go eat it. Go sit down. I'm gonna wait to please sit down. It's been already. An hour, and you're still eating. In an hour, I'm gonna go back to your classroom, and you're gonna be in your classroom, gonna be like 20 minutes late. Still came sooner than the teacher. Teachers are God knows where. Where, where. where am I actually? Hold on. There am I. There's me. Like 30 minutes late. I think it's because time. I think I'll. It, I, 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 I don't like it when in games the. Uh, Time scale is too off. I don't like that. Oh, we have the computer lab, all right? We have the money back. Awesome. You guys completed. Amazing. And we actually have another grant we can totally do right now because we have cool points in this one, right? Yeah, it's gonna give us 5,000 bucks again immediately. And we can also do this one as well for another 5,000 bucks. Awesome. We're really close to doing this one as well. Sophomore students, we'll get to that soon. School health is gonna be one of our next goals. Let's not take actually anything right now. Finish the classroom. Let's hire some teachers. Let's hire some. Let's hire Josh as a teacher. Uh, that's a nice signing bonus. Pay him a lot, but that's okay. Let's hire Josh. He's gonna be teaching over here, and let's hire let's hire like a random uh, in-game person. Fine. Well, let's do it a few cycles, and let's get I don't know who looks. We don't need a good teacher. I actually want to get an okay teacher, right? Let's get Emmett. I like the name Emmett a lot. He has a master's. Right, 5,000 bucks for him. That's okay. Let's hire you over here. So we're gonna be in that classroom, right? Yeah, we can also like rename these classrooms. They should have a, a teacher assigned immediately because they put them directly in there. They do. Classroom 3. We can rename this one. We can name this to Josh's class. There you go. This one can be... Oh, don't remove it. Don't edit. I can't edit it until it's uh, fully built. So we're gonna have to wait for that. We have some money now, we can have a decent income. Again, we are actually spending more money now because we expanded a lot. But that's okay. Just get more floors in here. Make it a little bit nicer. Just spend all the money on concrete tiles. There we go. And let's might as well like fill this in as well. I'm gonna block those walls off at one point. It's a pretty big school, I think. It's actually a really big school. I like it a lot. Okay, so what now? We have some more money. I think I want to hire... I want to wait until tomorrow until we get the cash flow. We're going to hire more janitors. Because it's getting a little bit too dirty right now. Which I don't like at all. Going to wait for them all to leave. They're still cleaning out the garbage. Yeah, they're way too slow. There's not enough people working here. And it's getting really dirty. We're going to have like 40 sick people tomorrow, I think. Why are you still in here? Resting. Really? You know you can just go home, right? There we go. 
There's still someone. Okay, never mind. We're done. <gasps> Final exams? Oh my. Oh god. That's actually really bad because we just. Oh god. Alright, let's see how they do. Okay. 73% pass. Grade B. Okay. How come almost everybody failed? Not almost everybody's failed. Results. Oh, we can see him oh, bit by bit. That's so cool. Failed. Results. Pass five. You failed PE, really? Yeah, you failed a lot of subjects. You failed math? You had a good grade in that. You seem to at least seven is pass, huh? Alright, I guess a lot of these are new people, right? Evaluation? Okay, all grade B is B. That's awesome. Next school year. So I'm guessing they now advance sophomores. Actually, just slow the game down. Uh, did that happen? Oh, we have a bunch of new students. <gasps> I didn't turn on the transfers. No, what? How did my... Oh, it... How did I get so many new people? Did they really? No. What? How? Why? Do we get like 70 new people all of a sudden? Oh, because that's how many classrooms we have. Really? That can't... Why? I can't keep up with this. I mean, we have a lot of money now, but... Oh god, alright, let's actually build uh, one more, let's have like five of each, oh my god, I don't know what to do. <laughs> I don't know we got so many people all of a sudden. Um, I would really like a clone tool, to be honest with you. Um, okay, first of all, we're gonna hire some staff. So it's uh, year two, still quarter one, that's, that's okay. Let's get a few uh, more janitors, one, two, three, four, five. We have a lot of money, so we might as well invest in uh, some new little improvements. Okay, I have going to be another classroom over here. We we'll need a um, lot more concrete over here as well. With this, like, make these new concrete as well. We're gonna need some more. We're gonna need some more um, classrooms, if you will. Okay, I, I want to actually have a few classrooms over here. Can I squeeze in a few classrooms in here? So it's they're ten, 10 times twelve, right? Is the outline. It's 12 times 10. All right. How many can we squeeze in here? Say that it's 10. Times 12. Wall. This one doesn't fit. No, it does fit. Because it's not the wall. Hold on. Race. It will be here, right? Then this would be... It would actually perfectly fit two classrooms. Which is good. But then we have nothing to... We're gonna expand our computer lab here, right? But the problem is, like, 10 times 12. I wanna make a computer lab bigger. This is not 10, actually. This is wrong. What if we do, like, 12 times 10 times 10? Doesn't work at all. All right. Uh, so the computer lab doesn't need to be any wider, I think. That's good enough. So we definitely want to have like a 10 times 12. 10 times 12. Right? And we're gonna have this 10 times 12 as well. So this, these are the same size. This gonna be two new classrooms. We can actually do the same thing over here. So let's have like 10. Are these the same even? They're not? I made, made a mistake. To be like this. Do the same now. Ten and ten. All right. So that's four new classrooms. We add even more. Can we squeeze in another classroom over here as well? We can totally squeeze in another classroom over here, right? We have five classrooms in the computer lab. This could be for our sophomores. Also, all of our layouts disappeared. With the new year, I don't like this at all. Uh. I don't know why we have so many students all of a sudden. That doesn't seem right to me, guys. Like, maybe you get a bunch of students every year, but if they don't advance to sophomores, they will never leave school. They should have, like... Look at their evaluation. They should have not failed, right? They should have succeeded. Maybe some of them are completely new. I don't really know what, what, what's the meaning of this. But it's, it's way too dirty right now. Alright, we gotta hire, like, a bunch more janitors. That's probably way, way, way too many. 
Right, uh, let's get... Just go into concrete, honestly. Just, like, make everything here into concrete. Even the, even the under the walls, I don't really care. Get a bunch of new classrooms here. Just make this inside wall. Yes. No, not concrete wall. Oh, no, 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 I made a huge mistake. Uh, blue wall instead, yes. Yes, okay. Oh. Don't make it out of concrete, that would be really bad for business. Too expensive. Okay. There we go. Are this... That's concrete wall, that's okay. Could get these things as well. Probably get stuck in there, but I don't really care. Okay, so... We'll build these. There's gonna be a bunch more classrooms, and I also wanna get... You know, to build, get more walls over here. The corridors are four wide, right? So we have one, two, three, four... Like this. Get the red one. Build, give me more concrete tiles. I'm getting a lot of money every day, so we don't need to worry about future too much. There is a wrong wall here, it seems. I know it's a different color, but it is okay. Um, I still don't understand why we got so many new freshmen. Like we get too many freshmen, way too many, unreasonably many. This thing is still not finished because they can't actually enter it, it seems. They're way too busy, they have way too many things to do. Okay, gonna hire like a few more workers. Ooh boy. Okay. If we had like a copy tool, that would be glorious, but we don't, unfortunately. That's a thing they should get in the game, honestly. Especially if you're like me and you like having things be very uniform. Like, if I have a classroom, I want all classrooms to be the same, basically. go that we still have to decorate these guys why is this different it's a concrete wall i see i built the wrong wall here huh yeah there we go that's that that's a big problem oh i get for can do you get money for canceling these hold on i do not okay so that's kind of a shame that we you know deconstruct them that's fine. I could actually build, make these walls red, make it a little bit more colorful, a little bit less bland. If school is dirty, students might get sick. Yeah, I know, I can see that. Also, there's way too many kids here. It's kind of crazy. <laughs> it's really crazy. Uh, how are their needs, though? Motivation's going down. Food is low, fun is super low. Why is fun super low? I don't know. They should have more fun, I guess. They don't know how to have fun. Uh, we're gonna get more grants finished though, because we have us 100 students, right? Yeah, there we go. Maybe we didn't get any sophomores because we didn't do the sophomore students. Let's do that. I could have done this though. Uh, I wouldn't manage to do that. But it's gonna be easy, just gonna finish this off. Need to finish this thing as well. We're gonna have 528, that's not gonna be enough for all the students though, is the problem. We're gonna have to add some extra chairs everywhere, I think. Because if we wanna divide 166 with 5, uh, 166 divided by 5 is 33.2. So we need 33 chairs in each one of them. Need, we need, each one needs at least 5 more chairs. 6 more chairs in each, every classroom, out of these 5. We could do it, like, just add six chairs in each of them and then we move them next year. But, I don't know, it feels like they're so disgustingly dirty in here. Oh my god, why they're so dirty? They're not supposed to be that dirty, it makes no sense. Look at all this. Holy sacks. It's insane. Everyone's going back home. Look, look at them, they're, they're walking on my things. They're not walking on the path at all. <laughs> I hate that. They should, like, walk on the path. They should get a speed boost for walking on the path. Frankly. More stuff in delivery still. 
Right, new day. How many are sick? This might get sick. Well, I don't care. <laughs> Just clean it up, guys. It's your job. Your sacred duty to clean this place up. So these are like advanced classrooms. I want to make them... I should have actually made them a little bit bigger, maybe. Because I don't want to have them be the same. Oh, can I even place these facing down? I can. Facing up as well. So what I'm going to do in these, I'm going to actually make them a different shape. So I'm going to... You mean the same shape, but they're gonna be facing a different way, is the thing. That way you can fit in more people, I think. Just me. Hold on, give me, give me a second. Student chairs. So how are we gonna do this? We're gonna have like a bunch of people in the back. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's gonna be like eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten people in the back. It's ten. Yeah, it can be bigger, I guess. Maybe a bit more. Proud of we can have like a thing that's in the middle that's open. Maybe the sides could be open, I don't know. They can just walk in. Make it seem like a I want to make it seem different, you know? This is a good ratio, though. So we have, like, three spots for the teacher in the, in the front. That's okay. I like this a lot. I'm gonna do it quite nicely. We might actually even make him face the middle. The teacher is always in the middle. We could even add, like, a staff door in the middle so people can just walk around. That doesn't make much sense, but I don't mind. It would look cool. It will look cool. I know it will. I'm still trying to keep up with my future. Made by the bell, I guess. It's still super dirty. Being good, and I'm still way too slow to build stuff. Again, I have so much income right now. I think it's worth to get a few more workers build the stuff. Because we are in constant building mode right now, and it's still super dirty. So again, three, four, five, get more, more of these guys. Just continue doing what you've been doing. Food is low, fun is low. You're gonna go eat now, right? So it should be better. Lunch time. And a lot of them still don't have a teacher. Which is a big problemo for me. Uh, can I get a classroom here? Class. I can. Awesome. First one classroom. And we're gonna get a teacher. Get someone who's fairly good. Get Emily Atkinson over here. There you go. Awesome. You should be assigned to a classroom, right? I think so. Okay. So I wonder if some of have any different gameplay mechanics or if they're exactly the same. It would be cool if they were a little bit different. These are all freshman classrooms, right? And classroom. I don't know if that this, what this changes. We'll see soon enough, though. Gotta wait for them to build this. And also, we will need... I might want to have them all face the same way, you know? I like a door. Each, like, in the middle here, I guess. Like that. Again, I can always change the location of the computer lab later. And turn this into another classroom. It's easily done, the computer lab is not crucial to be in this location. Might actually just get another, like, thing over here and have this be the park.
On this side here is the freshman wing. That's that's the goal. Make sure everything's really close to them, because oh my god, there's so many people here. Oh boy. Still super dirty. They're taking dirty. It takes I think it, it gets so dirty so quickly. It's this is like not normal. It's only this dirty if it's really rainy and muddy. And it's neither right now, so I don't think it's realistic. We're supposed to get this dirty. Gonna hire after them tomorrow. Tomorrow, once after our, after our cash flows goes by. All right. There you go. Seven more janitors should be enough. Take him a while. Chalkboard, student chair, office table chair. Still missing a lot of things. This chair is facing the wrong way, I just realized that. So I'm gonna go over here into chairs and make it face the right way. All right. Janitors never hang out in their room, by the way. They have the room, but they never use it. Fifth chair absent due to sickness, that's insane. <laughs> that's kind of crazy. Oh lord. Day three. So it's I think it's was it twelve days last time or ten days? I don't quite remember how many days we, we did. Might have been ten. No it no it No it was it was ten because we got the other dudes on the tenth day, right? Not quite sure, I don't remember the exact number. I have to check that. At least I like the library, I guess. I'm gonna add more of these and make it look a bit nicer. We have some money now. You know what? Let's go finish our library. Okay, so I think I'm gonna do it like this. This seems like a decent compromise, if you will. So this gives us a lot of like bookshelf space. Almost looks fairly okay. Unfortunately, you can't make them face up, but that's it's it's no be. I think this is gonna look fairly okay. Not the best looking library ever. But it's not like fully symmetrical, which kind of frustrates me. Okay, just ditch these two, I guess. You look up. Yeah, it looks even bit better right now. Yeah, it looks okay. I also like wanna ditch these instead. And be like more to the top. And have some more over here. It's gonna even out over time, right? Just keep adding more more things. We could just add, remove these, have them like this, and have them like this. That's a lot of like her libraries, a lot, lot of, lot of stuff here. It doesn't, doesn't even out. Ah, uh, never mind. Let's ditch this entire bottom tier idea. Go like get ditch this as well. Let's add them like this right here. these I like this this is good I like this a lot we also add some t desks here right next to the to the books that will look good because usually you need to have some extra desks, desks right for the books that makes sense to me I like that quite a bit I like it it's a big library it doesn't have to be super massive but it needs to be fairly fairly possible which it actually is it's gonna take him a while to build this because again we have a lot of things a lot of projects going on at the same time but still it's fairly fairly fine all right, so we're still missing this. I wish there was a way to prioritize what they are working on. Again, so many deliveries here. They can't bring everything over here. I think we can't keep up with the demand, right? You have like so many additions and whatnot. Need more cooks. Too many cooks. <laughs> Just make him do stuff. All right. I don't want to keep our students hungry. Fun is so low. Fun, fun is... I've never seen fun be so low. I don't, know, I don't know what the problem is. I honestly have no idea. I'm guessing it's... Because... There's... It's too dirty, it's too crowded? I don't really know. It's getting kind of cleaner now, which is good. You guys are not carrying it anywhere. Why are we getting so many deliveries if our fridges are still super full? I don't understand that. Also, I would like a separate fridge room. 
So eventually I'm probably gonna like move this faculty room, move it somewhere else, make the, uh, this entire thing into a kitchen. Then after a while we can ditch the club as well and make it into like a fridge room or something. If necessary. You guys are still hanging out here. They're gonna hang out here forever. There we go. Fine. Time skip. <laughs> they slept on the floor. Oh, that's kinda cool. I like it a lot. Alright, just continue doing your job, guys. We have so many dishes to wash. No one's washing dishes, actually. That's a big problem here. There we go, finally. Wash some of these dishes. The students can finally eat. We have an empty fridge here. So we actually have room for this to get filled in. Why are just hanging around doing nothing? I don't know. I think with deliveries, depending on the amount of students, students every day, but they don't have enough fridges to store everything. So that is a problem. 65 absent due to sickness. That is a big number. That's a pretty darn big problem. All our workmen in, are in this area now, working on stuff bit by bit. Okay, alright, so we have the library almost done. I wanna just have him, make him finish this, you know? We have money, just get a bunch of dudes. Invest, because we need to expand our school rapidly. We need some sophomores as well. I don't know how the advanced sophomores can actually do some research on that. Because I figured the people who passed would move on to sophomores. That would make sense to me, honestly. No? Like from year one, freshman to year two sophomores. Maybe they did. Maybe these are like entirely new students, but since we didn't have any freshman classroom, no one came when you arrived. But again, why would we have so many people? I, that doesn't make much sense to me, because we have... Is it maybe counting the library spots? I don't know. Vision is super low. So yeah, we're doing pretty poorly. Because our fun is at an all-time low. Well, I'm guessing it's because of... The clubs. I'm guessing it's because they're trying to go to a library, but the library is so far away, they don't have time to get there. That's my hunch. Okay, we have some more clean dishes. Finally eating properly. There we go. Good job, everyone. These things are almost done, you poor man. You're stuck here. Um... Don't remove the tile. Oh god, what have I done? A menu open here. Let's get a door here, honestly. This guy to enter. He beat on the floor. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Let's build a door here. They're gonna build it eventually. I cancel. I didn't want to cancel the tile. Okay, hold on. Let me just fix this Get tile here. Get one over here, and get one over here as well. We're gonna need it anyways, soon. Just go build that someone. Okay, they're all leaving. That's okay. Yeah, these guys are, I think the problem is they're getting stuck on carrying the, the groceries. Like, half of them are carrying groceries, but there's nowhere to carry the groceries too. Because the fridges are full. And we get more groceries every single day. Which is bad. Real bad. And I don't think this garbage is working. Oh, it's, uh, it's, it's it should be working. I think that's a big problem right now. Like there, we have our workmen are stuck carrying groceries. I have, like, there's nowhere to carry them because we don't need more groceries. They just arrive every day for no reason. They're still sleeping here, and they're still trying to do the same thing. They pick them up and they just hang around. There's nowhere to carry them, and we have so many of them, and we get new ones every day. I think it's. Let's go to like zones. Let's uh, zone edit. Can't even edit the zone here, huh? Really, I can't edit any zone actually. Yeah, delivery zone. Remove the zone. Then go to delivery and make it like super tiny, like this. Delivery like this. Seventy-four apps new to sickness. That's actually horrible. Oh man, our school is gonna be so boned. This guy's still stuck. 
Lures are still causing us problems. These guys are literally sleeping. I think they're literally dead. I think this guy is completely dead. He got crushed by the weight of the carrots. Rest in peace, Genesis. Rest in peace. One's gonna go here. Please just finish this classroom so I can finally start doing classes here. It's missing a chair still. Just get the chair, guys. Get the chair, you know. There we go. So this should be a proper classroom, right? We should have a teacher in here and, and everything. Uh, zone, zone edit, edit classroom. Yeah, we have a teacher. Classroom 5. Emily Atkinson is in here. She should be doing her job. I hope you guys are still stuck in deliveries. That's kind of unfortunate. But we have these things mostly done. So let's finish these. These are still being built. That's okay. Also need some things. Can look better. Let's finish this as well. And that's going to be most of the stuff done for our workers. We can finally focus on some other things. But yeah, we can actually... I gotta make six sophomore classrooms, to be perfectly frank with you. Just ditch the computer, leave the computer lab here for now, later on ditch it, and we're gonna be fine. I'm gonna also move the faculty, probably gonna move it to over here, gonna make a little wing over here just for the faculty and whatnot. I'm gonna modify the faculty to be in the next part of the kitchen to get more fridges, because I think that's the problem here. I think we don't, our kitchen is actually too small right now. And it's not able to keep up with all the demand. I think that's the biggest problem at the moment. And also I want a special cafeteria just for the teachers. I think that's a thing we can do. By just put just by putting a, a staff on the door on the front. And no one's gonna enter Bart, but teachers and the staff. But it's gonna be pretty cool. But yeah, I'm gonna actually just end this one here. Thank you all very much for watching. My name has been Twisted. Find a better game style. We'll see you next time.